The Tesla Powerwall 3. It's the most popular home battery in the United States, but is it really the best? I don't think so. In today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you five reasons why I believe the SIG Energy Sigen Store 5-in-1 beats the Tesla Powerwall. The smarter way to go solar. All right, now in today's video, we're talking about five reasons why the Sigen Store system from SIG Energy beats the Tesla Powerwall. Uh, and the first reason, of course, is the modular stackable architecture. Now, what we mean when we talk about the modular stackable architecture, in, instead of having one monolithic battery, basically the system is broken down into individual components where each one or each individual building block is man portable with only one or two technicians. So if you look at the Sigen Store 5-in-1 system, at the top here you have your controller, which is basically your, your hybrid inverter. Then optionally you may have the integrated DC EV charger and then one or more energy storage modules. But again, no one of these individual components weighs more than about 100 or 120 pounds max, which means that you can do the installation with only two technicians and you don't have to use any special lift equipment. So for you installers out there especially, planning the, the logistics and the organization of your teams, you don't necessarily have to bring along a forklift or, or you know, cranes or any, any of this special lift equipment that can increase the complexity and increase your time on site for the install. Uh, it also means that you can maneuver into harder to access places like basements uh, or smaller homes where you just may not have that much clearance away from the wall to deal with specialized equipment. So that modular stackable architecture is something we've been hearing very positive feedback from installers as far as really minimizing the time and the complexity for the on-site install. Uh, it also means that you have flexibility in terms of being able to expand the system later. You know, depending on what your needs are and what your budget is, you may start with a smaller system with only one or two battery storage modules and then expand the system with additional modules in the future uh, as your energy needs increase. Now, as of this recording, SIG Energy offers a six kilowatt hour and a nine kilowatt hour energy storage module. So you can, you can mix and match the different sizes within the stack to get to your desired level of energy storage. Of course, the second reason is the lower pricing. Now, SIG Energy has been very com uh, price competitive as they're coming into the US market. Uh, of course, SIG Energy, when they first came into the US market, it was under the Point Guard brand and the Point Guard home. But now they've moved everything to the, the SIG Energy brand, which is the, the name of the international pa parent company. And they're also using the international product name, which is Sigen Store or the Sigen Store 5-in-1. Now, it used to be that they were pretty much on par with Tesla Powerwall in terms of pricing. Um, but what we're seeing now is total system cost anywhere from 20 to 30% lower than a Tesla Powerwall based system. And as your energy storage increases, you know, from that right, right now, Tesla Powerwall is still at that 13 and a half kilowatt hour level. But what we're seeing is as you scale your, your system storage size beyond that, your total scaled cost per kilowatt hour is significantly lower than Tesla Powerwall. Uh, and that's because again, the, the, the company right now is trying to do everything it can to help installers stay competitive and stay profitable as we deal with some of the challenges that we're facing in the marketplace right now. Namely, the loss of the 30% personal tax credit at the end of the year, uh, and of course, higher interest rates compared to where we were a few years ago. All right, the third major advantage is the intelligent smart load control. Now, when we talk about smart load control, what we're basically meaning is that the system will automatically power on or power off certain devices or appliances within your home to help you uh, both stretch your battery runtime if you're running during a blackout, uh, but also helping you to optimize on your rate schedule. So if, if you live in one of these areas where you have pretty big difference between your, your on-peak rate versus your off-peak rate, you can use intelligent load control to help you maximize your energy savings. Or tell the system to run certain circuits off of solar and battery power only, so you're not having to draw anything in from the utility during those peak rate hours. So intelligent load control is great for both maximizing the payback on your battery system or for emergency backup purposes, if you're forced to run off the battery during evening hours during a grid blackout, uh, perhaps you can automatically power down high draw non-essential items so that you have more running time on your battery for those most essential items like lighting, refrigeration, uh, and water pumping, of course. All right, the fourth major advantage is generator support. Now, for those of you who've been following me for a while, you know that generator support is one of those features that I advise you to have 
If you're truly preparing for an off-grid operation or to help survive a prolonged grid outage. So what generator support is, is it's the ability to interface a, a traditional fuel burning generator, like gas or propane, into the system and use that as an alternate means to recharge your battery. So let, let's say you're running off the grid, there's a blackout, maybe the weather's still bad, so the solar panels are not keeping up recharging the battery fast enough. With a generator support option, all you have to do is fire up the generator for a few hours, let the generator power the house and be recharging the batteries while it's running, and then you can shut the generator off and go back to running off of battery power. So, you know, depending on the size of your generator, it may only take three or four hours to fully recharge your batteries. That way you're not burning fuel all day. You shut that generator off before evening hours so you don't have to hear that thing running all night. And then you can just go back to running off battery power. If the next day solar can take over, if you've got good solar production, solar can take over. Or if you have to, you can run the, the generator for a few more hours the next day, but you're not running that generator 24 seven. You're using it as an alternate means to recharge your batteries and really helps you stretch your, your fuel supply as well. And then finally, the fifth major advantage is SIG, SIG Energy offers the world's first ever fully integrated bi-directional DC EV charger. Now again, those of you who've been following me for a while know that this is the most eagerly anticipated technology of 2025, the, the ability to have a fully functional bi-directional EV charger. And the reason this is such a game changer is because, you know, especially for those of you who have already made the investment in purchasing an electric vehicle, th these electric vehicles have very high capacity batteries compared to a normal home battery. Uh, and so if you've already made that investment in the vehicle battery, having the ability to interface that vehicle with your home solar and storage system can give you a number of benefits. First would be, you could have prolonged whole house backup if we can tap into the energy in your vehicle battery and use that for backup power. So if you don't wanna to have to buy another you know, 40, 50, 60 kilowatt hours of storage for your home, you can go with a smaller stackable system and then just interface the EV charger as your extended backup. Uh, of course, the other reason is because if you wanna take advantage of load shifting, again, with that high capacity battery in the electric vehicle, you could run the home off the vehicle battery during certain hours to avoid peak rates. Uh, or in, in some cases, you actually may wanna pull out of the vehicle battery and export to the grid if they're offering you a premium export tariff, which we, we've seen in some of the California utilities at certain times of the day, they're willing to pay you over $1 per kilowatt hour during cer certain peak rate times and peak months. And if you have that energy just sitting there in your vehicle battery, you can easily pull it, dump it to the grid, and then you can wait until after midnight for off-peak hours, or just wait until solar comes up the next day and recharge the battery then. So these are the five main reasons that I believe the Sygen Store 5-in-1 system from Sig Energy beats the Tesla Powerwall. Hey folks, as always, if you get good value from the videos that you watch on Solar Surge, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Uh, also, go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. That way, as we have new videos like this coming out, it'll come up on your recommendations and you can stay up to date with everything. Uh, of course, if you're a homeowner, if you're in the process of looking at solar or battery storage options for your home, uh, or maybe you already have a solar system for your home and you need to get uh, upgrades or service, we're gonna have a solution for you very soon as well. Uh, but as always, feel free to reach out to us on the website here. You can set up a call with one of our experts or just use the free online calculator tool to see how much solar and battery storage cost in your area. But that pretty much does it for today's video. I thank you all for spending some more time on the Solar Surge channel. And as always, I'm Joe Ordia here, encouraging you to get prepared and be empowered. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.